All right, everybody. So today we are going to alter the Google Stadia controller to have full Bluetooth support. We're going to connect it up to the Steam Deck and we're going to test it. So we're going to go ahead and use a standard USB-C cable. I'm going to plug it into my controller and then I'm going to plug it into my PC. All right, it's definitely alive. Let's go ahead and go to the website. And right here it says switch to Bluetooth. And uh, you can switch to Bluetooth mode. It does say though that switching is permanent. So we gotta be ready to accept that, but Stadia is going away, who cares? Accept the terms of service. I could have read through the terms of service, but I didn't wanna spend an hour of my day. So it says to plug it in, which we are already plugged in. And hit continue. And now it says allow Chrome to verify your controller. I'm using Brave, so any Chromium browser will probably do. All right, so it does say that there's a Stadia controller connected. Do I have to click it? Yep, click connect. Oh, I have to charge it. So your battery is at zero. You need to be charged 10%. It could take up to 30 minutes. And I'm here to tell you it actually did take about 30 minutes. Okay, so now we're back. And um, <laughs> hey, wait a minute. It's not detecting the controller now. Hmm. Well, I left this little part in here because I thought it would be important. I tried unplugging, plugging it back in. I did everything that I could. I reloaded the page. I went back a page. And while it detected the controller the first time, it would not connect the controller after I charged it. So I can tell you what's going on right now. The controller's actually powered on. Once it got some juice, it turned itself on. In order for this to work, you need to plug the controller in with it turned off. So go ahead, if after you unplug it from the charger, it's flashing or it's lit up, hold down the Stadia button in the middle until the power light goes out, plug it back into your PC, and you should be good to go. All right, so now that we've got that little problem figured out, let's go ahead and continue. We'll allow Chrome again. All right, there we go. Yay, it's charged enough. I had to do like three times before I could get 10%. Okay, so this looks pretty simple. Unplug your controller to power it off. Hold down the three dot button while plugging in your controller and then press those four buttons at the same time. It sort of makes you wonder if this didn't work all the time and we were just sort of tricked into not thinking you could get Bluetooth support in it. Well, I went ahead and did it. There's no hepatics, there's no lights, there's nothing that actually shows that it did anything. So I wasn't actually sure if it did anything, but let's try it anyway. All right, we now have to, again, authorize Chrome access to it or Chromium. Ooh, it says something different now, that's cool. All right, downloading Bluetooth mode update, so maybe not. Downloads complete, next step. Install Bluetooth mode. So once again, oh, now it's a USB composite device. Ah, the magic behind the curtain. So now it's installing the Bluetooth mode update. Don't unplug your controller. Probably why you wanted it at 10%, right? So I'm not cutting it out or speeding it up or, at all. I just want everyone to be able to see what's going on here. And there we go. That's it. Bluetooth is installed. Let's... That sounds good. Let's try it out on the Steam Deck. Okay, so first off, we had to put this in pairing mode. So if you hold down the button, it will eventually show that the Stadia PJM8 is available. I paired it up, and I happen to have a game of Gears 5 in progress, so we should be able to just hop back out here and test it out. That's weird. It's kind of working, but not. Okay, I can't really move right. It's not letting me move at all. All right, well, maybe it was locked into a different controller or something. We'll go ahead and shut it down. We'll start it over. And let's see if the Stadia controller works. That's better, yeah. Okay, this works, great. Listen, I hope you enjoyed this quick look. Thanks, like, subscribe, you guys know what to do. I'm Shane Armonroe. Thanks always so much for watching and take care.